Welcome to Sammy So's Kitchen Cooking Experience Thing Part 2. I will not lie, the money serving as my motivation. Think of a stallion and a couple that's a cool relation. They see my presence in the game, it's like a fumigation. And when they pump and wide, so it's like intimidation. Nachos, we're making nachos. Tomato sauce. Oil. Hot sauce. Too hot, boy. Doritos. We love those. Lemon juice. Oh my God, sauce. Onion. Fries. Bell pepper. It's hot. Tomato. Yeah. Chicken. Ooh. Avocado. Some people might just hate me now. Cheese. Of course. Spice. My dog. Spice. 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 And that's all the things you're gonna need. <laughs> Take that chicken and put it in a bowl. Put that ah. in the microwave and put it on melt. Nice. Now you take your onion and then you dice it. Nice. Avocado poop. Doo doo. Add some lemon juice. Then you take a piece of chicken, you put it on a plate, and with telekinesis, you dice it. Nice. I'll repeat. With the bell pepper, you put it on a plate, and with the power of telekinesis, you dice it. Nice. Put it all in the pan, and in the meantime, you take your spice, and you spice that chicken. Once your pan looks like this, you can take all of this out then, and then add your chicken. Yeah. Chicken. Mmm. Two minute break. Nice. Your chicken should look like this at this point, so you add the hot sauce to it to give it a little. Mm. You know what I mean? Since we've exhausted our telekinesis powers, you're gonna take every single tomato and you're gonna cut it up nicely. You're gonna dice it. Cause we're almost ready to plate. Time to assemble. Grab your Doritos and put them all on a plate. Don't forget to make funny faces. Then you're gonna grab your chicken and make sure you spread it evenly amongst all Doritos cause we want an even coating. Vegetarians, you might wanna look away. Mmm, chicken. Now grab the onion and pepper mix and just add it on top of everything. Yeah. Tomato sprinkle. Had to switch it up to a top down view to give y'all that good, good cheese sprinkle angle right now. Look at all that cheese spread. More. If you're lactose intolerant, you might want to leave the kitchen right about now because things are about to get real ugly. You're going to take the entire plate, put it in the microwave, and just send it. Just, just send it. Once you see bubbles, then you know what's ready. Just send it, fam. Wow, wow, look at you, no longer useless in the kitchen, you're no longer the toast and tea guy, you're no longer the cereal guy, the one egg and bread guy, you can now successfully make a bowl of nachos, and before you go, uh, oh my god, it's gonna be soggy, shut up, shut up, just listen. And that's how you make nachos. That's right. Crunchy. Now everybody's favorite part. Man, don't you know that I'm loco? <laughs> Hmm.